Brazil unearthed remains of 70 million years old, two-legged, toothless. A research has established that the fossilized bones of a toothless, two-legged dinosaur unearthed in Brazil reflect a new species that existed between 70 and 80 million years ago. Berthasaura leopoldini, a substantially entire specimen, was described as a quite unusual discovery by researchers from the National Museum of Brazil. As part of research in the Cruzeiro de Oeste municipality of Paraná State from 2011 to 2015, it was discovered in the Cemeterio dos Pterosaurus Quarry. B. Leopoldini was a tiny carnivorous dinosaur, measuring about 3 feet, 1 meter, long and two and a half feet, 80 centimeters, tall. A toothless, beak-like mouth was a surprise to the team, which was headed by National Museum of Brazil paleontologist Giovane Alves de Souza. As the squad put it in a statement, it was a great surprise. A whole dinosaur from the Cretaceous era was discovered in Brazil, they stated. This animal's lack of teeth raises issues about what sort of diet this animal had, Mr. Alves de Souza said. However, this does not rule out the possibility that it consumed meat. Many birds, including falcons and buzzards, devour meat using their beaks. If it was an omnivore, it would have had to consume whatever that came its way in an unforgiving environment. The Cemeterio dos Pterosaurs quarry's name suggests that B. Leopoldini is not the first fossil to be discovered there. Cemeterio dos Pterosauros quarry is noteworthy for being the first pterosaur bone bed from Brazil, revealing two separate species. In contrast, the existence of dinosaurs at the site was recognized straight from the outset, the researchers said. Bertha Lutz, a renowned Brazilian scientist and politician, died in 1976, and the species Berthasaura was named in her honor. In honor of the Brazilian emperor and patron of science Maria Leopoldina, B. Leopoldini is named after her. Scientific reports reported the study's results in full.